Hey everybody, Dr. Howard Cohn here at the Cohn Health Institute, and today we're gonna to talk about the differences between allergies, hypersensitivities, and things of that nature. You know, there was a time where we could eat anything. Our grandparents would eat anything. They would eat dairy, they would eat bread, they would eat all these things, they would eat peanuts, but now there are peanut-free schools, gluten-free menus, uh, dairy-free choices everywhere you go in the restaurant. What happened? Did the food change? You know what, it did change. It's not the same, the cows are not genetically the same. The milk is not genetic, it's genetically the same. The foods are genetically modified. It's different. And you do a cycle or two of that going through your body, now your body's different. And now there's more gluten in, in the bread. There's higher casein in the dairy. Uh, the things that we're eating, that we have vaccinations that are, have peanut oil in them. It's crazy. These are the things that cumulatively are affecting our health. Guys, you know what? Uh, we got to do our best to get back to the wholest, purest foods out there. You got to eat organic. You got to eat raw when possible. It is not a luxury anymore. It's a have to. You got to find ways to get products, get nutrition in you that's gluten free and dairy free and soy free and nut free and nightshade free. And stack your body with these things and stack your body with these foods so when you are eating the things you know are hurting yourself, uh, you're not going to get hit as hard and then realize that you know there are things out there that you can take nutritionally to fill the gap between what you're getting in your diet and what you're supposed to be getting in your diet to help you offset it so you can still live a life eat some fun foods and still function well so guys moderation is not the key anymore you gotta stack it way high at least 80 percent with organic raw whole foods whenever possible and you know what no one force feeds anybody, unless you're a baby. If you're an adult, it's you that's picking up that fork and that spoon and cutting that knife and shoving that food in your mouth. Make more conscious decisions because if you don't take, your, take care of your health now, you're going to watch it go away. And it's a whole lot easier to stay well than it is to get well. So guys, do the right thing. There's much more better strategies these days in order to do it. You can go to restaurants around the world. They have other choices now. But you know what? When you can eat at home, when you can grow your own stuff, raise your own stuff. You know what? It's making a comeback. So stay healthy. Keep healthy. That's our tip for today.